A photo album with faded pictures and a single birthday card helped Marilyn and Hud Ringo preserve precious memories of their daughter Tammy. But within the memories, the pain is also preserved. And unless you have lost a child, you don't know the feeling. You don't know the hurt. On December 9th, 1972, a much younger and pregnant Marilyn was pushing a baby carriage along 7th Avenue East in Owen Sound, her toddler son Sean in tow, when a fishtailing car approached from the north. And the car seemed to straighten out. So I said to Sean, okay, come on, we're all right now. And I looked up, and the lights were there. And he had hit her in the stroller. The driver of the car sped off into the night. One-year-old Tammy Ringle was pronounced dead a short time later at the hospital. Today she's still in my mind. She's still a year old. And uh, she's laying there like a, just like she was sleeping. She still had the resuscitation tube down her throat. It looked like she had a soother in her mouth. The driver of the car was never found. Forty-five years later, the Ringles are still grieving, still waiting. We're left hurting while someone else went on with their life. Give us some tips and give us an idea. Give us some closure. Police have recently reopened this cold case after finding new information. Tomorrow on CTV News at 6, I'll have the latest on their investigation and why the detective working on it believes this case is solvable. Roger Klein, CTV News, Owen Sound.